these BCS bowl games, John. Mm -hmm. So far, uh, lots of offense. Yeah. Right. Close games. Yep. Key missed kicks. Well, the Orange Bowl tonight, uh, West Virginia, Clemson. They did have the offense. Lots of kickoffs. The rest of it, not so much. Discover Orange Bowl. Let's discover how many points we can score. First, though, uh, Dabo Sweeney firing up his Clemson Tigers. There ain't no channel flipping tonight. There ain't no one show off. Hey, you either ready for the big stage or do not. So here we are, baby. Everybody got that? You either let your light shine or you hide. Let's let it shine. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, so it was a very good speech. Um, it just didn't take. First quarter, West Virginia driving. Geno Smith pass complete to Andrew Bowie. Uh, Bowie nearly tackled by Richard Hall, but he, he rolls off and just keeps on a run. And look at this one more time. He, he looks like he's going to go to the ground, but his bum never hits. And uses his hand to keep himself balanced, not the elbow. So he gets to just run free a little longer. A couple of plays later, Sean Alston straight up the middle not touch. West Virginia's first touchdown of the half. It's seven all. So it's important to point out to the folks at Clemson they did score first. In fact, they were at 14-7 when Tavon Austin goes right side. Dives for the pylon. We got a counter. We say that's two touchdowns. We look at the replay again. Austin diving. He's inbounds there. Show me the pylon and the ball. Knock it over. You know what that is? Tie game at 14. Second quarter, all Mountaineers. Geno Smith. Little flip to Austin. He gets the corner. Little hesitation. Zip, zip. Stays in bounds. West Virginia, the counter now. Listen, if you have a counter, that means there's going to be a lot on your side. <laughs> Tiptoes along the sideline. Stays in bounds. Great play by Austin. Sweeney, he, he's going to talk to his defense, but I'm pretty sure that's a different kind of talk that's getting right there. Ensuing Tigers drive. Now, this is where the game turns. They are threatening to take the lead. Ellington, pounding up the middle. And the ball taken out by West Virginia back the other way. The Mountaineers took it out of his hands. And Darwin Cook is racing for a touchdown. How about that turnaround? Oh, man. Yeah, we look at this again. There was a lot going on there at the pile. And all of a sudden, Darwin Cook was away from the pile. The cameras barely could catch up. And you see the ball comes out from Andre Ellington. That is a turnover, and that is Cook racing 99 yards for the touchdown. Hot Bob the Big Horn. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We have abuse of a fruit, and then he wasn't feeling good, and he went to go over there. And, well, he puked. Oh, he'd be fine, though, apparently. The rest of the orange, everybody else in orange had some tough, tough moments. Gino Smith going to keep that one himself. He's in again. Uh, your TD counter is at 5. It's 35 20. And we still have two minutes left. Well, not much can happen there, right? Well, no, Clemson, Todd Boyd pass. That's kicked off by Pat Miller to the Mountaineers, set up deep in Tiger territory. This is pleasing to the old grads. It's pleasing to the young grad, uh, lads. It's pleasing to kids who might someday in third grade think about matriculating at West Virginia University. Austin again, 6 TD in the half. It's 42 17. Next Tiger drive. Maybe we should just get to the locker room, shall we? Boyd takes off, scrambles downfield. Ball comes loose again. Another Mountaineer on it. Initially ruled down by contact. You think it's their night? That's going to happen? No, that ball is punched out by Bruce Irvin before Boyd's knee touches down. That is a turnover. Mountaineer football. Second and goal. Why don't we get one more here before we go to the house? Alston plows in. Seventh touchdown of the half. The Mountaineers their a new bowl record with 49 points in half. 35 in the second quarter. But again, Clemson did score first. McCracken. McCracken, is, he had some offensive ball plays, and he wanted to still run. Coming out in the third quarter, Geno Smith, Stedman, Bailey. Same old story. Inbounds, pylon, touchdown. That's eight for West Virginia. That's so many were losing the counter. What I'm telling you is this is not going to come down to a Bill McKenzie field goal late. Smith, Tavon Austin again. That's nine touchdowns for the Mountaineers. Fourth alone for Austin. We should play the fourth quarter, don't you think? They don't have a mercy rule in these things. Mountaineers deep into the fourth quarter. Willie Milhouse. I'm not sure that kid's even listed in the program, but he got in and scored. 10 TD for West Virginia. 70 points. It's a new bowl record. Baylor, they had the mark for an entire week. Last time West Virginia scored 70 was in a game. Uh, 80 against Rutgers 2001. The 10 touchdowns ties the record for any bowl game set by Nebraska in 2000. West Virginia basically scored the most points in a BCS game.